and welcome to another Sunday plan with me. Today I am planning out my week of September 17th through the 23rd, uh, over here 23rd. I am still using my A5 printables from Jesenia's printables and I am still loving them. Um, I'm going to try to make this a quick, uh, quick video today. I am so excited. I'm meeting up with one of my um, high school, actually two of my high school friends um, that I haven't seen in a long time, but they're here visiting. They're here in town. So um, we're going to try to meet up for dinner. So I want to try to get this done as quickly as I can. Um, so if you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, and let's go ahead and get started. This week I am using a kit from my shop called Blue Flowers. I decided that orange is my theme for this month of September. So this kit has little touches of orange through it. Um, so I thought it'd be nice with the, just to keep in the theme. So here are the full boxes for my kit, the ombre heart checklist that I do little glitter hearts, the half and quarter boxes with some page flags, the washi strips and cut strips, the glitter headers and little things, and then my date covers and then sidebar stuff weekend banner. So I am going to go ahead and get this started. I've already gone ahead and um, sliced using my slice tool uh, from that I got from Amazon. Um, sliced it up so that I can lay my bottom washi down. I'm also going to be using some Simply Gilded washi this week too. So I'm going to use some silver foil this time. So I just brought out the whole all three sizes that I have. Um, so we'll see how I can use that throughout my spread. So I am going to get started with whiting out the bottom, laying down the basics, and then I'll come right back to you. Here is the week laid out. I decided to just go with the more traditional um, full boxes down the center, ombre heart checklist across the top, and then I'll use the bottom as my today section just because I want to try to kind of get this going as quick as I can. So I'm going to zoom in. Let's get going and get ready for Monday. Okay, so for Monday, I don't have a whole lot of stuff other than my daughters have another performance with their with their school group so i want to mark that so that i can remember that they are going to be out of school uh -uh. right off the bat i have to fix that Especially since this one had lines on it. Okay, let me just set that one over there. It's not that necessary to put that particular sticker. I can use any of them. I'll just use this one. All right, so I'm too impatient to let this dry. Okay, so my girls have another performance. So I'm going to use a Coffee Monsters Co. Musical Emoti to mark that. And then I do have just a couple of meetings after work. Well, at work and after work. So let's see. This isn't really the same exact pink, but that's okay. I'm going to mark my meetings with, let's see. I think I will do, I'll do this little clock to mark those meetings that I have set for Monday. And then that is it for Monday. Actually, let me see if I have a little icon here that will remind me to throw out the trash. Mm. Well, we've got a vacuum, we've got a little house. I think I'll just do, 
Actually, I'm going to do this little check mark to remind myself to gather up the trash. No, I don't want to do a check mark. That doesn't make sense. I'll do a little house. And I'll put that right here in my to-do list to gather up the trash for trash day. Okay, so now for Tuesday, at work we have some visitors coming in um, to do our finance literacy program. That is on Tuesday and that's with our sixth graders. So I just kind of check in and make sure everything is running smooth with that. So I'm gonna use one of these little very cute designs and I'm just gonna use one of these pens. Um, I think I'll use the pink. It's not exact match, but that's okay. I'm kind of going with pink a little bit here. So I'm gonna use that for our um, school visits. And then again, I have a couple more meetings. So I'll use the same sticker as before. I've got another one here. So I'll put that there. And then my children and my husband have their rehearsals again. So I think I'll just use another quarter box. And I think I'll use, I kinda wanna use, I'll use this orange one for their school rehearsal. Actually, I have two meetings on that day, so I'll put it a little lower. There. And I'm running out of small little emojis. Luckily, I've already ordered some more. But if you guys have any suggestions, I mean, I love using these guys, but I'm using them every week. If you guys have any other suggestions for me for like musical performances, um, practices, things like that, any other shops that carry cute little musical stickers, please let me know in the description box below so I can check them out because I love looking up new shops or new to me shops. So that is Tuesday. Now we are on to Wednesday. Okay now, so for Wednesday, um, it's kind of like a repeat of Tuesday because we have our visits again for our seventh and eighth graders on Tuesdays at sixth graders. And then on Wednesdays, it is seventh and eighth graders who go through this financial literacy. So I'm gonna put another marker on here. I like to mark it because I gotta make sure that everything is staying on schedule with our teachers and with these volunteers. So I just like to notate it since it, they're not coming to my own classroom since I don't have a classroom. I just have to make sure that I remember that they're supposed to be there so that I can check that they that they show up and that they're on time and that everybody has the materials that they need. Um, okay, so then on Wednesdays I meet, I have two more uh, meetings on this day. So I think I'll use now, I guess I'll use this little at symbol. We'll put that there two of those and then I think that's it for Wednesday so far so pretty good and then let's move on to Thursday okay so now on Thursday is an exciting day at work Thursday our school is having cheerleading tryouts and the new advisor has asked if I can help with the tryouts so if I would be a judge so I gladly accepted I used to be the cheerleading coach at our school and I was a coach for like a total of, I don't know, six or seven years. And then um, it was just time for me to pass on the torch. So we had a different teacher doing it last year and then she moved to a different school for this year. So then we have now a new person doing it. I'm gonna use these little heart eyes for these cheer tryouts um, from Fox and Pip. And it's so fun. I mean, I loved doing it. It was a lot of fun to do. But, you know, it's nice when um, someone else kind of steps in and starts doing, you know, you see, see the excitement again for somebody doing something different, something new, something fresh. I mean, I kind of had exhausted all of my ideas already so it was kind of nice to pass the torch on to somebody else so but I'm still happy to help out in any way I can and so I'm excited that she asked me to be a judge for her um, and then on Thursdays as usual my children and my husband have their rehearsals on Thursdays okay 
So this is the first half of my week right here. It looks so pretty. It's just like soft colors. Looks really nice. All right, now let's move on to the second half of the week here on Friday. Okay, so now for Friday. Friday, um, I have to remember that I have to make sure that I drive myself to work because um, so my husband and I, we work together and we typically, I mean, we always drive together. But on Friday, my two daughters invited some friends over to spend the night, which means I have to drive them. And so we won't all fit if we only take one car. So I'm going to put a half box here with this. Uh, don't forget, I got this little sampler from Gabriella Designs at Plantation. So I'm going to use this Don't Forget because it's so pretty and it's silver. And I'll lay that right on here. Don't forget that I need to drive myself. So let's see. I think I'll try to use one of these larger ones since I haven't used this size yet. Yeah, that'll work. Let me just lift it up. Hopefully I don't mess up the foil. Don't forget, there's my little girl to remember to drive myself. And then I have these cute little, um, this little sampler sheet that I got from a meetup here in Vegas. And I thought it was cute, this little girl on the unicorn. It just looks like fun. So I'm going to put that here in the white space and then just write, you know, girl sleepover. And they're going to go crazy, I'm sure. Okay, so on Saturday, we have another girls' night, which I'm super excited about. We had a fun time this past Friday just hanging out. So we decided we're going to do it again. And we are all going out on Saturday. So I have this little um, freebie sampler that I got again from Plantation. So it's a girls night, busting out the rosé. Super fun. And that's all for, for Saturday. And now we are on to Sunday. And as of right now for Sunday, the only thing I have on my pre-planned notes is get my stuff done for YouTube. So this is what this half of the week looks like. So let me zoom out and get both pages side by side. So again, not a whole lot of stuff for the week as of right now, just lots of work and meetings and things like that, but it will most certainly get filled in. That's why I like having um, this space set up because each and every day I have this laid out in at work and then just each day I just start listing out things that I need to do so that's nice I just realized also that I never finished up my sidebar so I'm going to finish up that sidebar now let's see let me grab those headers again actually I'm going to use I'm going to use some of my simply gilded washi my skinny washi So I'll lay this here. Again, I just keep a simple sidebar. I just like to track my dinners for the week, track my, do some habit trackers. Let's see, I'm gonna keep it light with this pink. Do I need a white amount? Mm. I think it'll be okay if I don't. I'm gonna flip this over. Oh, I probably should have wetted them out. That's okay, no big deal. And then let me put another piece of this Simply Gilded. 
I know there's lots of people. I'm because I'm on the Simply Gilded um, Facebook page and lots of different planner groups. And I know some people are like, "What's the big deal with Simply Gilded?" Because whenever she has her um, pre-sales or her release days or whatever, you know, people go crazy over it, right? I'm one of those people. But um, and then others are like, "I don't know what the big deal is. It's just tape. What's going on with it? Why is it such a big deal?" And really, truly, it's not that it's a big deal. I know that a lot of people buy it so that they can end up reselling it and it's so much more expensive. That's not my life. I don't always do that. I know that sometimes I'll get like subscription box and there's things in there that I don't particularly care for and then I will put stuff like that on the buy sell trade but I'm certainly not trying to just make a buck buying it and then reselling it. But I got to tell you I have tons of washi like all different kinds of washi and this particular brand of washi it's just so smooth like it rolls off the off the spool here smoothly it sticks nicely like it's just it's just so much easier to use like I don't even know how to necessarily describe it it's just so much easier to use and um, you know when you buy it from the website it's not at all that expensive I mean it's affordable it's just if you miss out on it and then you end up looking on those buy sell trade groups you know some of them are the you know the markup on on many of them is is quite up there so I mean some people spend twenty thirty dollars on one roll of washi and I know that that's kind of crazy for some but for others like that's their that's what they like so you know more power to you those who want to sell it and those who want to buy it whatever floats your boat okay kitty do not come up here again okay so now here is my spread I'm gonna go ahead and fill this out I'll grab one of my pens and fill it all out and then I will come back to you with the finished look okay so here is everything filled out with the information that I currently have I used another one of my papermate flare pens kind of like this rusty orangey color um, Every sticker shop that I used, including the tools that I used, will all be linked down below. Again, I do have the affiliate code for um, the tools that um, I use every week. So like my slice tool, the undo, the whiteout, and these pens. Those are all under there in the description box below as well. And um, it was great hanging out with you again another for another week. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye.